Huh. What's that block? Up. Early. I think we could just run in this crazy dog right here. This dude just seen a cat and he like, he didn't know what to do. He didn't know if he should like attack it or like stay away from it. But <laughs> he, he didn't know that that cat would, that cat would mess him up. Let's get it though, man. Let's get it Monday morning. Uh, getting back on track. I've been staying up, been staying up late for the last few days, just trying to pound away and get a lot of stuff done because you know I know I'm leaving for a few days. And I'm not going to be doing the usual workload, so um, that was part of the reason why you know staying up so late. But getting back on track because you know I actually like I actually like getting up early and running and getting off to a good start. You know. Uh, feels good, man, to know that I've already accomplished so much in such little time <clears throat> of, like, running the dog, excuse me, water, that's that water, but yeah, it feels good knowing that I've accomplished so much in so little time, you know, of, like, running the dog, going to the gym, uh, getting, uh, getting my to-do list out of the way, you know, getting my mind right. Um, doing a little bit of like visualization in the morning, or vision, you know, I mean, like before I even step foot out of the door, it's all good, man. The first hour to three hours of the day, it's just like so positive. It just kind of like, like launches me through the day. But, uh, <sighs> to get this running real quick, real quick, like the window so it can be better. I had a pretty good workout. I hit my legs, hit my pencil sticks today, and uh, felt pretty good. I focused mainly on my quads and my glutes, and uh, tomorrow I might hit the uh, hamstrings and uh, more of the glutes. You know, I, I don't really try to go in there and kill myself with legs. Um, I just want to have some nice toned legs and build them up slowly. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to not be able to like sit down, you know, uh, and, you know, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, but, uh, anyways, I just, yeah, felt good, <clears throat> feels good when you work out and you sweat, I think I really pushed myself to that point, and I used to push myself really hard to the point where it's like, I'm sweating so hard that I'm like, I'm like dripping sweat, you know what I mean, I used to push myself that hard, and in those days, I mean, of course, I mean, it was, it was years ago, um, not to say that I, I am like a lot older now, but I mean, I was in, it was in my early 20s, but I mean, I can still do that, but damn, uh, I'm there, but I don't want to go there just yet because I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to rush, you know, um, because I mean, I think the reason why I say that is because I just want to make sure that I, I take my time and I build my muscle the right way. I know I've been out of the gym for over a year, so I'm taking my time with this. It's barely been like a month, month and a half maybe that I've started going back to the gym. So it's like, I'm not trying to, like I said, I'm not trying to rush that. But anyways, headed back to the house. Um, yeah, I'm going to figure out what to do today um, or what I want to accomplish today. I'm going to write that down, what's more important to get done. And um, I don't think I have any meetings today. So just listening to a podcast right now. Excuse me again. With talks about um, putting on for your city, or just knowing that everything you do shouldn't be for you; it should be for everyone else. That's a very unselfish way. I mean, of course, you have your long-term goal, right? But uh, at the end of the day, like, like it's all about everyone else, you know, and, and what you can do for other people. So um, that's a little food for thought. That's something to think about. And that's actually been something that I have been thinking about as of late. I've been thinking about like finding my niche and figuring out, you know, what can I do? How can I show up every single day to give back uh, or provide value in a certain niche every single day? You know what I mean? Every single day and every single way, you know, video, audio and, and print. How can I do that? What is that thing? What is that one thing? Um, because I like doing a lot of things and I just, uh, right now my, uh, I'm trying to get aligned with that one thing, you know, because once I do, then I'll be able to go deeper and a lot deeper. So that's what it's all about, man. That's what it's all about. <laughs> this 
is such like a Scooby-Doo moment. <laughs> he's waiting for me. Look, he's waiting for me. Go, Bates! He's waiting. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Kobe! <laughs> so this is what's going on today. Um, I got to clean up some rooms here in the house. Airbnb, I got to clean up both rooms because I'm expecting two brand new guests today. The guests that were here for the weekend just got done checking out. So that's what we got going on today. So yeah, I got to... Um, today I'm cleaning these rooms. What's up, dude? Today I'm cleaning these rooms. I got to... Task number one, clean this room right here. Task number two, clean the upstairs room. So, uh, let's get it. The first room, now I'm in here in the second room, grabbing all the sheets and everything off the bed. Uh, right after this, you know, I got the laundry going, but after this, I got to clean the bathroom. So, just wanted to pick my phone up, man, and show you guys that I'm working. You know, this ain't no, uh, this ain't no fairy tale. You know what I'm saying? I gotta put in the work, dude. Put in the work, you know what I'm saying? Taking out the trash, look. Gotta take out the trash, trash need taken out. You know what I'm saying? Gotta clean the bathroom, gotta wipe the mirror off. You know what I'm saying? This ain't no game. You see you see that man right there? That man works. That man works, baby. Let's go. <coughs> Taking a guacamole break. This stuff is so good. I like to eat my guacamole with Doritos. It's uh huh. It's so addicting. Mmm. Oh my god. Listen. I try to eat as healthy as I can. But these chips here with this guacamole, it's probably one of the things that I cheat. <coughs> Ooh. It's spicy too. It's probably one of the things that I cheat with. <coughs> I cheat the most with, with this guacamole here. With the Doritos. I know it's not good for me, but my god, it's just so good. Just want to give you guys a quick update. So I finished cleaning the rooms, and um, now I'm just sitting here. I'm about to dig into a little bit of work right here, just a little bit. Um, it's 3:20. It actually took me quite a bit of time to clean up because I actually swept and mopped the entire downstairs and pretty much cleaned the upstairs too. I got a pretty big fucking house. It's like 3,500 square feet. So I cleaned two rooms plus the entire downstairs, swept and mopped, and um, yeah. Now I'm about to get into this. This action right here, so it is what it is, man. Just putting in the work. The summertime, and like, as you can see, sun's beaming. The sun, the sun sets on the on the west, and so our house is facing west. And uh, I'm here in my garage, and it is like stupid hot. It's like stupid hot, and I got to turn these damn lights on and record a video. Let's just hope I don't start sweating bullets. As I'm uh, doing my thing, I guess it's going to make a lot of sense for me to, to start um, doing my video recordings in the morning. Or if I have to create a video, it'll be best to do it early in the morning. I would say 7, 8 a.m. Because I just, like when I turn these lights on, I know it's just going to be hot as shit. So, anyways, let me get this done as fast as I can. Uh, that took two minutes, but I'm sweating, yo. I'm starting to sweat already. Ugh. This is nasty. I'm not looking forward to going to Charlotte because I already know it's going to be humid as hell over there. Whew. Yo, just wanted to check in. Still working. 8.49 p.m. Still going strong. Just doing my thing, man. Just how I flow.